Welcome to the Local Pundit. I'm Josh Anthony. This is your Wrexham Reaction for Match Day 16, and it was a big one. Knotts County versus Wrexham AFC, and uh, I got to tell you, we came up with a big win, 2-0. Unbelievable. We just did a watch along. Fantastic. Uh, fantastic. Fantastic support. Everything. Big win. The game changer of the season. I believe this is the way we're going to kick on and keep going. I <laughs> That was a lot of fun. And yeah, that's entertainment. That is fantastic to watch. I thought the team put a, a great display in. Um, I think we kicked every ball on the uh, on the stream too. So going to dive into it and talk about the game a little bit. Uh, yeah, and uh, just uh, see what we think. I, you know, going into it, uh, you know, Parkinson. I thought uh, I didn't. I didn't quite like his lineup, but what do I know? I'm just sitting here in a chair, and he's managing the, the team. So it's fantastic. But a big win. We are up to third place with 30 points, tied with Knox County, who we just beat two nil away at Meadow Lane. Fantastic. Oh, fantastic. So, yeah, this is great. So, um, Match Day 16, he attended 16,083, 200, 16,083, let me slow down, uh, 2,863 traveling away fans to um, to, to Meadow Lane from Wrexham. Fantastic. The support is ridiculous. The, the It's it's so much, it's great to see. It's great to see. And, uh well done to the team. They put a great shift in. Uh, Knotts County uh, didn't play bad. They had some great shots on goal. Uh, I thought their midfield was, was was good. I thought some of their players on the left and right side did really well. So best of luck to them. You could see why they were a good side. McGoldrick played well for them. Um, and uh, you know, to be fair, it was it was a really good match. It was a, it was a it was end to end. Um, and um, you know, like I said, it's one of those games. It was going to be a great over the. Uh, game over the weekend and this is this is it this is us going away and getting three points at Knotts County after what we did last season together uh coming up great you know to be the man you got to beat the man and we're still the goddamn man uh Wrexham still have Knotts County's number so awesome um let's get into it let's talk about the starting lineup uh so in the initial starting lineup uh Tonic was in the starting lineup um uh he we, he did his uh Harkins did his normal Five three two, which was great. So he had a uh, 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 Oconquo in the back with uh, O'Connor, Tenacliff got injured in the warm up, and then uh, Tozer came in. Evans, Mendy, and McLean uh, because Barnett was injured. McLean on the left, Lee, uh, Cannon, and Jones, Dalby, and Mullen started. So I didn't like the Dalby starting of the game. I don't think he's a bad player. I just I would have started Palmer, although Palmer did come in and score, and so did Lee. Uh, 73rd and 76th, 73rd and 76 minutes, respectively, and they two were great goals and fantastic. Um, but I didn't like the Dalby starting up front. I think he had a good, uh, I think he had a okay match. It was kind of out of it a little bit, to be fair. Um, we were kicking the ball long to him, he didn't control the ball, um, the way Palmer or Fletcher would, would control and get the ball bounce off to Mullen at um, and once. But the pattern of play, uh, it was, um, you know, we were sitting back, we weren't pressing up in the first half. And, um, and you know, by the stats, you could see that uh, Knott's County uh, were keeping the ball on the ground and they were holding the ball um, uh, in possession uh, more than we were. But that said, uh, Tony Fico going down uh, and Tozer coming in on last minute notice of being injured. I thought Tozer was fantastic at times. Um, he, um, like I said, coming in is great. My man of the match for me is either going to be Evans or O'Connor. Uh, leaning more toward uh, O'Connor. Love to see what you guys think in the chat. Guys and gals think in the chat. But O'Connor or Evans for me, I thought played really well. Mullen, uh, the assist to Palmer for the goal, that second goal uh, was fantastic. Um, I thought he he did well after getting an early ridiculous yellow card that should have not have been a yellow card um, with Jody Jones, who who was uh, you know I said on the stream sag was on strike but he's still acting uh so uh you know palmer played really well sorry mullen played really well while having a yellow card for i don't know what was it um i don't know how long he uh, how long he had um let me see here he got his yellow card really early james mclean got a yellow card jody jones um 37th minute yeah mullen got a yellow card in the 37th minute so uh and in playing the rest of the game you know, 50-odd minutes plus four uh, to, with the yellow card was great. So he played really well. Elliot really, his goal, um, he wasn't on the ball as much as he used to, as he was, you know, in the previous games, but he did come up with a goal. And he's been um, he's been fantastic this season. Uh, he had his 
Uh, how many goals does he have this season? Let's take a look. Uh, his goals are, I don't know, I think he's got 10 or 11 goals or something like that. Let's check it out. Uh, Elliot Lee, for me, uh, his goal, fantastic. Uh, so Elliot Lee has got, um, he's played 16 games and he's got 10 goals. So for me, fantastic. Uh, fantastic. His goal had a deflection, but it was, it was on, it was on, it was on frame. So it was going in. It did get a deflection goal with a goalkeeper, which is great. And then, um, yeah. So I also really liked, I really like, um, I really think that, uh, that Evans is really coming into his own. He played at the back today, uh, but he was really just, um, playing, um, Usually he does a break, break a play in the middle of the field, but he, he sat back. He was in the back line today, and he was really pinging the ball left and right. I thought he did a really fantastic job. And to be fair, you know, even though I didn't 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 like the Dolby starting, who cares? We got the three points. Didn't work. It did not work because it worked. Uh, the changes that Parkinson made were great. Uh, he brought on um, he brought on Palmer, and uh, <clears throat> excuse me, brought on Palmer. Um, and he brought on Luke Young at the end there and uh, and uh, Steve Fletcher, who also played really well at the end there. They worked. When the changes came in, Parkinson knew how to, how to just – he knew what he was doing. Um, uh, they they had us penned in at, at points which uh, were concerning. I thought our, our defense held up really well. I thought Okonku yeah, had, just had some fantastic saves uh, uh, in that second half. And he's really coming into his own, really coming into his own. Uh, he's, I know he's on loan. I think he's on loan from Arsenal. I keep saying, I think I, he's on loan from Arsenal. That should be a permanent deal. I'd love to keep him, uh, for next year and moving forward. He's a young kid. I think he's 22, 23 years old, 24 years old, something like that. Uh, he's got great presence, got very great calmness. He's long. That's a really great save today. Uh, right after, right after we scored our first goal with Lee, they came right down the pitch. McGoldridge, I think had a right footer and he made a fantastic save to keep us in the match. So, uh, if, you know, between, the back line with Tozer, O'Connor, and Evans, and Okonkwu, I really liked it. really liked it. I thought Mendy did okay coming in. Uh, I think he's better uh, as a defensive player than a than uh, an offensive player. Uh, Barnett is injured. I do, we don't know how long he's out, but I want to see how long he's out. And O'Con- O'Connell is also out injured. But Mendy went down early with an injury. Uh, he we looked like he might want to – he might – be coming off, but he, he ended up playing the entire match and he played, he played really well. He was battling that kid, Jody Jones, the entire time, um, down that, down that left side, down the right side. Yeah. So I thought he did really well defensively, uh, going forward, you know, I, I'd rather, I prefer Barnett, but, uh, again, this is a big win. We are on 30 points. So here's the, here's, here's how it looks with the, um, the live, the live, uh, the live standing. So Stockport, I've played 16 games. They have 35 points. They have won their last five games. Stockport County are a serious, serious side. Uh, and I'm sure they're going to be up the, the, the entire season. Knott's County, who we just beat 2-0, have 30 points. Lost today, obviously. Wrexham, 30 points in third place. Uh, are, you know, are getting a lot of green on our last five. Two wins, draw, two wins before that. So that's really good. Under us, uh, towards 29 points is Mansfield Town. They won today. Crew Alexander, 29 points in fifth place. And Morkham, uh, 27 points uh, in sixth place. And Accrington Stanley under them at 26. So we're where we should be. Um, we're chasing. We're right in the mix. Uh, we just keep this up. We're great. Um, uh, touch wood that everyone stays fit and we keep going. I thought Parkinson was really great today. I give him an eight out of 10 and how he, uh, an eight, eight and a half out of 10, maybe on how he, on how he, um, you know, managed the team. Uh, Palmer came on, put a shift in. You can see after the game, uh, he was tired. He, he came on late, but uh, yeah, this is a big win. 16,000 people, uh, 2,800 coming through. Wow. So it's so good to see positive support and, you know, uh, and, and a team just, you know, building. And it's always tough to come up in this, in, in a league. Uh, they came out of, you know, came out of national league and coming up and doing this. It's fantastic. We keep this up. Paul Mullen, uh, is, is, is so good. Uh, never stops running. Um, just a fun, fun watch today. Really enjoyed it. And, um, so next game coming up, what do we have coming up? Uh, we have matches coming up. Let's see. So uh, today we beat Knotts County. Uh, first, so next Saturday, Mansfield Town, Wrexham, twelve forty-five. So that's early for us here on the West Coast. But 
I'll get up for it and we'll watch do another watch along for that. But Mansfield Town and the FA Cup first round. So that that looks to be fun. We'll do that. Uh, and then we have November 7th, Port Vale and the uh, league trophy. That's a group stage. That's November 7th. But the next game is next Saturday. So no Tuesday game from I see right now. No Tuesday game. That's really good. So we'll get some rest. Um, we'll get some rest. It looks to be an away match at Mansfield Town. First round of the FA Cup. We're going to do that. So big win. That's your Wrexham reaction uh, after the watch along, which went great. And I appreciate everyone coming in, um, uh, coming through and, and supporting us. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, we're going to keep it going. So 2-0, Wrexham beat Knotts County up to third place, up to town. Let's do this. Have a great Saturday.